tonight, the latest on the corruption crackdown. Another North Providence City Councilman has turned in his resignation following corruption allegations. Councilman John Zamborano turned in his resignation to City Hall yesterday. In North Providence, Mayor says tonight he's now waiting for the third councilman to resign. Eyewitness News reporter Alex DePrado is live tonight with the latest developments from the Northwest Mobile Newsroom. Alex. Well, Catherine, as we've been reporting, all three council members are accused of taking a $25,000 bribe to change the zoning on this piece of land off Mineral Spring Avenue so a supermarket could be built here. And tonight, Mayor Charles Lombardi tells me he'll call on that third council member to resign tomorrow. Mr. Zamorano, do you sell your vote? I'm when North Providence Town Councilman John Zamborano left federal court Thursday after being arraigned on bribery and extortion charges, he didn't have much to say. But in a letter to Mayor Charles Lombardi, he says he's resigning from the town council. I think it's the best thing for uh, Councilman Zamborano, his family, and more importantly for the taxpayers and the residents of our town. It is the second resignation. Council President Joseph Birchfield handed in his letter of resignation on Friday. Lombardi calls the scandal shameful. I'm disappointed. I am uh, physically and, and, and mentally exhausted. The third councilman arrested, Raymond Douglas, is the only one that has not resigned. No one answered the door at his home Sunday afternoon, but Mayor Lombardi says he will call Douglas's lawyer Monday morning to ask for his resignation. Would you like him to resign? I, I, I think uh, that um, it would be in the best interest um, uh, for everyone. A special election must be held to fill the seats. The town charter requires it to be held 30 days from when the first resignation letter was handed in. I can't guarantee you this. There will be no more than one election. And a special election will co cost the town of North Providence about $20,000. We're live in North Providence tonight with the Northwest Mobile Newsroom. I'm Alex DeBrado, Eyewitness News.